welcome to another video by Snowball Ellie and today I'm going to be showing you how to make a scratch video a scratch game sorry so I'm going to be doing a step-by-step -step tutorial and this is the first part of the step-by-step -step tutorial so as you can see I have in the scratch editor so what you'll start off with is a sprite which is this cat here but I don't want the sprite so I'm going to click these scissors by here and click the sprite now what I'm going to do is make a background so if I get the fill button you don't have to do what I'm doing I'm just doing a nice little um, scene you can do under C or whatever you like but I'm just going to get choose underwater I'm going to make it very thick the thickest it goes so you can just do spots like this and then just colour it in now like this add a bit more and then that green get the box Oops. I can do it it's confusing sometimes when you do it because it will never work oh there we go it works so now I'm going to create a sprite so what you do is you have a choice choose sprite from library it's the first choice then the second choice is paint a new sprite third choice is upload a sprite from, from file fourth is new sprite from camera I'm going to paint a new sprite so if I have this then get the peach make a circle a circle up. Why doesn't it ever work? Circle. There we go. So I'm going just going to make a simple person. I'm gonna make a girl. So she's going to have a blue dress. You can make whatever you want. It doesn't have to be a girl it doesn't have to be a person even it can be a dragon or a lion or something I'm just going to do it simple and do a girl so now I'm doing the arms happy arms and then the legs then get some white for the eyes make it thick there. Uh, black, no, blue, blue, that black, and a big happy face. And all you need to do now is give her the hair. There we go. And if you want to name your sprite, you go and press the I. I'm going to name her Girl, as it's a girl. And that's all you have to do. Now, if you want to control her, go into Events. Go to press when green flag clicked. Then go into Controls, grab the Forever. Then put if then in the middle of it then go to sensing go to key pressed then what you're going to do is press the right arrow go into motion grab the change x by 10 now it might not work yeah right now she can go right now I'm going to duplicate this, change the right arrow to the left arrow and then 
put it by minus 10. So now she can go, if I press the green flag, now she can go left and right. But I don't want her just to go left and right, I want her to go up and down as well. So I'm just going to duplicate these. Then I want the up arrow, then the down arrow. But you don't want the change by change x by 10, you want change y by 10 or minus 10. So if I add on the down arrow minus, now she can go up or down. If I just sort this out. There. So basically that's all you have to do to control her. I hope I see you in my next part. So see you next time. Bye.